Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 edition. Page 415. Cerebellum. What are the responsibilities of cerebellum? The responsibilities of cerebellum includes to modulate movement and aids in coordination and balance. Where does the input information of the cerebellum come from? The input information of the cerebellum comes from the contralateral cortex via the middle cerebellar peduncle and it also receives ipsilateral proprioceptive information via the inferior cerebellar peduncle from the spinal cord. Just remember the input nerves are climbing and have mossy fibers. Describe the output of information from the cerebellum. The output of information from the cerebellum happens where the cerebellum sends the information to the contralateral cortex to modulate movement. In output nerves, the Purkinje fibers send information to the deep nuclei of the cerebellum, which in turn sends information to the contralateral cortex via the superior cerebellar peduncle. What are the deep cerebellar nuclei from lateral to medial? The deep cerebellar nuclei from lateral to medial includes dentate, emboliform, globose, and fastigial. What is the mnemonics to help you remember the four deep cerebellar nuclei from lateral to medial? The way you remember this is just remember don't eat greasy foods. So that's dentate, emboliform, globose, and fastigial. What is the function of the lateral cerebellum? The function of the lateral cerebellum is voluntary movements of the extremities. What happens in case of injury to the lateral cerebellum? In case of injury to the lateral cerebellum, there is propensity to fall towards the injured, so ipsilateral side. What is the responsibility of the medial cerebellum? The responsibility of the medial cerebellum is for balance and truncal coordination. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.